Hey guys, welcome back to my channel and to my home. Today, this is going to be fun. We're going to look at Ellen Villa Movie Star in Champagne Rooted. I'm going to review it, and then towards the end, I'm going to compare it to Gabor Sweet Talk. I have that in Toasted Pecan. Before we get started, please like and subscribe to this channel if you haven't already. I'm uploading like three times a week, and don't forget to go and follow me on Instagram at Crazy Wig Lady. I have all my wig giveaways, uh, makeup giveaways. We have Coffee with the Crazy Wig Lady. Lots of fun stuff going on over on Instagram. And also, be sure to stay to the end of this video. I will have side-by-side -side pictures of Movie Star as well as Sweet Talk and how they are similar. And I'll have some outdoor photos and all that is at the end of the video. So let's get started and look at these two sister styles. Okay, let's look at Movie Star. Like I said, I've already review reviewed Gabor um, Sweet Talk, and I'll link it below. But I just wanted to take Movie Star off my face a little. So I just pulled it back and put it in this clip, and that can really dress even a short style up. Like I've said before, just because it's short doesn't, doesn't mean you can't style it in different ways. And this has a lace front, so I want you to see that. It's really pretty. And just... Pull it off your face a little if you'd like, just to get a different look. But I enjoy doing that. Okay, this is such a cute, short, crop style. Lots of barrel curls. Just throw on and go. Really, really cute. This is right out of the box. I have a 21 and a quarter inch head circumference. This fits me perfectly. As you know, Ellen Villa are usually petite average, and this fits me just right. Uh, you know, I'm not a big fan, as I've told you before, of um, really getting, uh, pulling on these curls too much. I don't really like that. I like to leave them kind of how they are. I don't really want to smooth mine out too much, but you certainly can. Use a wide tooth comb, comb through them, smooth them out if that's what you prefer. I think I would just use a little bit of this sea salt spray on the ends of mine, just like that, and just separate them just a little bit. Just a little. I, I prefer that just a little bit messy, a little bit separated that's just my way everybody has their own way but like I said you could definitely just brush this out and make them a lot more smooth and not as PC if that's what you would want to do but I like it just like that I want it to be just messy and texture just a little separation there and that's the way I prefer to wear it now if you want to take it off your face just a little bit I just have some little Control hair you wear hairspray and I would just pull this up and spray it right across the front Let it sit just a minute and that as you can see will help you get it off your face also helps tame flyaways as well Easy out-of-the-box style Okay, let's look at champagne rooted. I've reviewed it before many times starts with a dark root and then it's blended in with these different shades of blonde, like beige blonde, medium honey blonde. It has a little platinum blonde running through here. Again, there will be outdoor video and photos at the end, so you'll be able to see that, I think, a little more clear. As I've told you before, with all of this studio lighting, on the blondes and, and the gray shades, they are brighter, in my opinion. You see them much brighter under these lights than you do outside. So I want to make sure you always see them in both places. But this is beautiful champagne rooted. Let me give you a look again at this lace front. Coverage, there's my bio hair. Here and here. I don't think there's any way that you need to do anything with that. Now, if you were going to wear this completely off your face, then yes, I would probably shade that in just a hair. But just to wear it casual like this, right out of the box, I don't think I would do any shading. Now, the bang on this one is 7 inches. My face is 9 inches from hairline to chin. The bang on this is 7, so you can see how this fits on me. The crown is 8. The sides on this one are 6.5, and, and it has a 3-inch nape. Okay, let's take a look at the inside of this cap. Okay, here is the look at the inside of the cap of Ellen Villa Movie Star. Lace front. 
down into the ear tab. Now it has a small mono crown. There is some permatease here, of course, to give you that lift on the top, but it has that mono crown, closed ear tabs with stays, Velcro adjusters, extended felt nape, and there is stretch in this wig. And here is a look at Champagne Rooted. Okay, here is a look at Gabor Sweet Talk and Toasted Pecan. Again, I will link the full video to it below this video. So if you want to see everything about this one, you can. So let's compare them. Now, Movie Star has a bang of seven. Sweet Talk, also a bang of seven. The Crown is eight on Movie Star, and it's eight and a half on Sweet Talk. The sides are six and a half on Movie Star, six on Sweet Talk, and the nape on Movie Star is three. The nape on Sweet Talk is three and a half. So you can see they are very, very similar in style as well as specs. So I think these are true sister styles. Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed this. Again, please stay to the end to see more photos of these two beautiful wigs. I really enjoyed making this. I really enjoy this style. I think this is appropriate for anyone, any time of the year. This color is gorgeous. Again, please like and subscribe to this channel, and I'll see you next time.